The Philippines is one of the countries that largely supply nurses in other regions, according to a report by the International Council of Nurses. Alone, it had provided about 240,000 nurses to OECD countries, even with the country's low nursing density. Prior to the pandemic, the annual outflow of nurses from the Philippines was around 15 to 20,000. But when COVID-19 hit, the government implemented an annual deployment cap of healthcare workers from 5,000 in 2020 to 7,500 recently. More nurses are expected to resign and leave the country, according to former Philippine Medical Association President Dr. Achenza. Kasi po, talagang during this pandemic, nahirapan na ating mga nurses at saka uh, sa rinig po natin, magiging devolved na yung mga nurses. Maraming mga nurses ang mawawala ng trabaho doon sa mga local government kasi ang um, pondo niya hindi naman gagaling daw po sa national, sa local na. And to prevent this to happen, Atienza made an appeal to President-elect Bongbong Marcos Jr. Sana uh, taasan ang mga, mga ano po yung uh, mga sweldo ng ating mga doctors, lalo na ating mga nurses, para hindi sila mag, mag, mag pumunta sa abroad at doon na humanap ng greener pasture. Napakahalaga po ng, ng healthcare workers, doctor, nurses, medtech, lahat po, pharmacies, para po sa ating ay pag ano po, uh, improve po at pag-umpisa po ng ating universal healthcare. An entry-level nurse in a private hospital makes 8,000 pesos monthly according to the report, while a nurse in a public hospital makes 33,000 pesos per month. Rosa Licoz, UNTV News and Rescue. We serve the people. We give glory to God. <music>